Hey, what is up guys, Aaron here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the what I think is the best app for note taking for the Mac. So it is called GoodNotes. Uh, now GoodNotes uh, is available on the Mac App Store as well as available for the iPad. Uh, and when you have it installed on your iPad and your Mac, you can actually sync between uh, both, uh, you know, both both devices, so you can, you know, you can use it on both the uh, iPad and the Mac, and they will, uh, the everything will will be in sync. Uh, I don't have an iPad, so I can't show you that feature, uh, but I do want to show you uh, how this app works when it's with the standalone, you know, when, when you have it standalone with your Mac. So uh, the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to go ahead and create a new notebook. Now this works exactly, you know, like if if you'd be at school, you'd have like, you know have a bookcase and you'd have your books in it. Uh, so let's go ahead and, and uh, show you what you can do here. So first of all, you can have a cover for a new notebook that you're making uh, for a new notebook. So I am going to, let's say, um, let's say I'm going to, I'll choose this cover called Fruitful. And then we can actually choose the type of paper. Now this paper will, will be as the default in the whole notebook, but you can obviously change, uh, change this, change, you know, every single paper as you go on. So uh, let's say, uh, actually I like dotted paper um, just for the sake of this. And then you can actually choose the paper side. So if you wanna, you know, in the future print it out, so then you can already use your notebook uh, in a way uh, that'll be easy for printing. So here we use A4 paper. Uh, and then let's see, instead of having dark paper, sorry, I'm gonna change it to, uh, let me change it to yellow. All right, so I have the yellow dotted paper and uh, I'm going to call this notebook, let's say I call it uh, Calc 1, for example. All right, so let's go ahead and create it and you can see that uh, our notebook opens up here. So let's uh, make this in full screen. And you know, you can see this is the, the cover. You can obviously, uh, you know, add text to it uh, and whatnot. And, uh, and this actually, let me zoom in. This is actually the fun stuff, the writing stuff. So now I actually have a, uh, a graphic tablet, um, but you know, you can, uh, obviously, uh, if you're watching this video, you're most likely uh, a person that has a graphic tablet. Uh, but let me go ahead and show you uh, how it works and how smooth the flow is. So let me just write, let me write hello world. Oops, excuse my handwriting. Um, all right, as you can see, it writes really, really well. Um, you know, the colors, uh, the color, first of all, there are lots of colors and, and everything looks great. And also you can, you know, customize it and, and pick a different color. Um, but I, I wanna show you the, the, the smooth and fluidness of, of, of the writing here. Uh, it, it's one of those things that, that it works so well and it feels, it feels very good to, to write on. And, and uh, you know, I, I, can, I can go ahead and do this. I can do this for a couple of minutes. Um, but uh, you know, th this is all I need. You know, I'm, I'm, let's say I'm watching a, a Zoom uh, on, on one monitor, and on the other monitor, I wanna you know go ahead and take notes. Uh, so you know, I have classes in, in uh, let's say in math. So so let's say we wanna go ahead and write down uh, uh, you know a limit calculation. Uh, let me let me make this small. So let's say lim from when x goes to infinity of uh, I don't know of, of four. Okay. So what would the limit be? The limit would be infinity. But um, you know, everything just works and, and, it, and it writes so smoothly and so intuitively. Uh, and it's one of those things that just works. Another cool feature is you can actually have a, like a laser thing. So if you want to show your screen to, you know, you want to show your screen on Zoom or something and you want to, you know, go ahead and show students something or you want to go to show your instructor something, uh, then you can use this kind of laser tool. Um, another cool thing is you can add pictures and and uh, you know you, you can add pictures. Then we have the lasso tool. If you want to move stuff around, we can select it and move it around. Let's say you want to select something individually, uh, then we can do that too. Uh, and, and it works really well. Then we have the shape tool that's really cool. So let's say uh, uh, you know I want to draw a square, and you know I don't really draw squares so well. So it'll kind of try and, and fix fix my sloppiness. Uh, then we have a simple highlighter. Uh, that's uh, you know, simple highlighter. Then we have erasers. Uh, the eraser works pretty well. I wish there was an option uh, for it to be like an eraser where when you hit something, 
it'll uh, erase. So let's say I wanted to just erase both of these. I just need to touch them, and they erase uh, similar to what they have in, you know, in, in Microsoft uh, Office. Uh, but it's no biggie. Um, and yeah, I think I showed you the drawing part. Obviously, if you want, you can add more pages to the notebook by just scrolling, or you can click here. Uh, and you can add a page with like a, a different template. So if we want to add a, a black dotted paper page, we can do that. And you can see that it, it keeps going in my uh, stream of uh, in my stream of papers. Um, um, yeah, we can add the different papers. And then once we're done, we can actually go ahead and export. So let's say we want to export uh, this. We can export it as a PDF. We can export it as an image file. Um, and then we can, uh, you know, just export it as a Good Notes file that that can be imported into, uh, you know, a different Good Notes, uh, uh, Good Notes on a different computer or on an iPad. Um, but this is usually what I do. I just export it all as PDFs, and then I have my PDFs. I can send them to my uh, friends. Uh, that is it. That's all I wanted to show you. Uh, again, you can use this to be super organized. You can see I have all my notebooks here. Uh, I don't actively use this. Uh, for school um, at the moment. Uh, at the moment, um, I use something else, but I'm definitely going to, uh, you know, very soon transition over to here uh, and, you know, cl clear this out, clear out things I don't need and just have my, my course books, my course notebooks uh, in an orderly fashion uh, here. Um, all right, I think that's it, right? As I was saying before, you can actually share notebooks and, you know, share them with friends and other people that have good notes. Um, and you can favorite notebooks as well. You have a couple of them. And yeah. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please feel free to subscribe. Um, and uh, have a great day.